Daishu, Daishu, can you not leave, please? I'm just leaving, that's it. Just one sec, wait, listen. I don't want to listen to you. Just listen to me. I don't want to talk to you. What, what is what? your problem? Can you okay, stop doing this to me? You bloody... Every couple goes through highs and lows. Every couple said once at least, we tried everything to make it work, but we're just too different. In fact, even I said it, but we all learn from our mistakes. See, we're on a mission from God. Are you the police? No, ma'am. We're musicians. Then Excuse I'm me? Dead. I'm trying I to work here? Really up shit creek. You know what? We actually never go out these days. That's not true. We just went out last week. But that was last week. Don't you like my company? Ingadan uh, Erka, will you please pass me that file? Oh. Don't you care? Are you not interested in talking to me anymore? Right now I'm interested in working. Will you please let me work in peace? You know what the problem is? You don't love me anymore. Of course, that's why I'm still here. Oh, so you're doing me a favor by being here? What? How dare you? What the hell is wrong with you? How can you talk like that? Look, I've How been can you be so insensitive? Just. How dare you? You don't love me anymore? In how many houses do you think this exact line is being repeated at this moment? You don't love me anymore? But you don't love me anymore? You don't love me anymore? But she doesn't love me anymore. After so many years, I learned to deal with that trouble situation. Never take a woman's phrases literally. It's just that stupid way they like to express themselves. Learn to tackle it. How could my boss treat me like that today? By what happened? He yelled at me in front of everyone. You know how bad that was? In front of everyone. Doesn't matter. Forget about it. Poor thing. Now does our men unknowingly start an argument here? What do you mean it's okay? It's not okay. You can't just yell at someone like that. You know how hurting that is? Listen, whatever your boss said, it doesn't matter. Be brave and stop cribbing about you it. You just don't understand my feelings. You don't even want to understand what I'm trying to say. He just yelled at me like that for no reason. Listen, I can't help you if you just want to keep crying like this. Seriously, I'm sorry, but I can't help you about that. Women need you to listen to them. Worst case scenario? At least pretend like you're listening. <gasps> oh my god, Sham, I can't believe you're being so unsupportive on this. Let's get this straight. Women are process oriented while men are solution oriented. You're late. Again. How could you be so bloody late? There's not a single time where you've turned up on time. Always tell me that you'll come but you never turn up. You're always late. Sometimes life can't be the way you want. My work was more important than you today. Don't be so demanding. I mean, I can't give you all the attention that you want all the time. Seriously, I can never change you. Do you always have to ruin my mood like this? Good. Leave me alone. Sham, you can't just walk out like that. Sham! Sham! Men need their space girls. Leave them alone when they really want you to. Sham, open the door, Sham! Sham! Sham, open the door, Sham! Ah, idiot! The worst and the most dangerous fights between couples are the ones where they get over-possessive of each other. We'll finish in one hour. Yeah, okay. So, I'm trying to develop my muscles like yours. Akshay. Amrita. I take a lot of protein shakes and things like that. Mm -hmm. Come, I'll show you some workouts. Yeah, okay, sure. Let's leave. Uh, I'm still not done. 
if you talk unnecessarily like this, this is what happens. Your spouse will treat you the exact way you treat them. It's pretty simple actually. If you're going to be over possessive, they're going to be over possessive. If you're going to flirt with someone else, then obviously they're going to flirt with someone else. But if you're actually going to be sweet to them, you have nothing to worry about. <laughs> I'm done, shall we move? <laughs> okay, then I'll catch you later. Yes, okay, yeah. bye. You just couldn't stop flirting with him, could you? What about you? At least she was hot, okay? Now that was the perfect example of how to make the worst comment ever. Never compliment another woman in front of your wife. Never say another woman is even remotely close to prettier than your wife. Especially when you have a pretty wife like this. What? How dare you say that about some other girl? And by the way, the guy I was talking to was much more charming than you. And again, the worst statement ever. Never damage their self-image. I'm a pretty self-image. Oh yeah, whatever, whatever. Trust me, this small issue of theirs is going to become the biggest issue of their lives. And they're not going to be talking for days. Um, <laughs> do you remember that issue we had where we almost didn't talk for a month? Oh, that. But it was your fault anyway. Um, no, it was your fault? It was totally yours. You blame me for no reason whatsoever that day. I mean, why would you blame me? Because it was your fault. Okay, 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 okay. We're supposed to be cute in this moment, so yeah. why don't you just, you know, chill out and yeah. See, it's this simple to make a relationship work. Marriage is not as difficult as it seems. There are a few tricks that I learned and you guys need to learn. Always make sure your wife thinks you're thinking about her even if you aren't. Text her when you don't have the time also. Always give her the attention she thinks she deserves. Listen to her. You're not even listening. Yeah, fine. As I was saying, there were these questions. Make sure she knows that you really love her. Do the smallest of things that'll make her happy. And the easiest trick of them all, hug her at every chance you get. Similarly, we need to learn some tricks as well. Vaishu, can we please leave this issue? I said I'm sorry. Please, it's Vaishnavi. not okay. It happens all the time and I don't like it. I am really sorry. I've already apologized so many times, Vaishu. Fine, okay. Thank you. Hey, Vaishu, just pick up my phone. Someone called Kamni. Just tell her I'm busy. Hello? Hey, morning. I, I'm just doing some work. Can I call you back? Yeah, 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 I'll call you back. Yep, yeah, bye. Don't you want to know who it is? Your girlfriend's your problem. <laughs> we tried everything to make it work, but we're just too different. I agree I said that, but honestly, love is the most magical feeling in the world. If we remember our differences, which we are willing to.
You can be the rain from the cloud when it's storming, or you can be the sun when it shines in the morning. Don't know if I could ever be without you, 'cause boy, you complete me. And in time, I know that we'll both see that we're all we need. 'Cause you're the apple to my pie, you're the straw to my berry, you're the smoke to my high, and you're the one I wanna marry. 'Cause you're the one.